I've created an app in a session config, and now I want to test it out. I can't run the app in Otree Studio, but I can easily download it to my computer and run it there. So if you haven't already installed Otree, you should do so, and the instructions are here in the download tab. But once you've got Otree installed, you want to open PowerShell to whatever folder you want to work in, and then start the server. So I type in Otree zip server and hit enter. Now it's waiting for me to uh, download my Otree zip file. So I go back to Otree Studio, click the button to download, and take that file that was downloaded and drop it into uh, this folder where you're running the server. But once you do that, you'll see that it will see that you downloaded the file and you should open your browser to this address localhost colon 8000 so I go localhost 8000 and I can play my game and if I want to make some changes to it then uh, I don't need to start the server again I can simply make those changes in Otree Studio um, let's say, for example, I don't want to ask, I decide I don't want to ask people their gender. So I go back here, uh, go to that page, and I remove the gender field. Now simply download the file again. And you see that the server restarts, it finds the new project I downloaded. And now I can go here, refresh my page and I can see that update.